what you do has to come some somehow has to come in a context of spacing and movement and shot selection and all that kind of stuff. So uh, you know that's that's what we're trying to get to is understanding how guys can help. Guys off the bench don't need to come in and score a whole bunch of points, but they need to come in and defend. They need to come in and board. They need to come and give us energy. All those kinds of things. Uh, no, I, th I think that, um, I think, for example, there are times when Dave gets tired when he's asked to do so much, you know, and Richard got two fouls, and this happened certainly in Hawaii, he's playing against the five, he has to rebound every ball because we're not big, uh, you know, he's our only inside threat. It, we're, we're effective when we have both inside guys and they can play off of one another because if one doesn't rebound, the other will. If one doesn't score, the other can. That's when we're best. When we go small, it changes things a little bit. And unfortunately, you know, we ran Dave into the ground in Hawaii because he, we just didn't have anybody else that we could go to. Uh, I'd like to see Dave get back to that shot blocking element a little bit more where he comes over and gets you the ball late on a, on a contest. But I do think part of that's because he's tired having to play as many minutes. It seems, it seems more and more that you, you want both the guys, Solomon and Kravish, on the floor together. Do you worry about when you're going to have to play without either one of them? Because you're, you're wanting to play them together. When are we going to have to do that? Is there a rule? Did I miss a memo? They can't go 40. They can't go 40 minutes. Either. No, but that's why Ricky's done a real good job of going in and, and picking up some of the minutes in there. Um, you know, but you know, we'd like to get Roger, bring him along, and, and be able to have him help. We said from the get-go that we're a big short, and we are. You know, so those two guys, you're going to have to, we're going to have to rest them uh, as much as we can and play off. But you know, hopefully, toward the end of a game, if they're both able to play, that's that's when we're better. Coach, what do you see from uh, Jordan Mathis? Um, he's pretty active in Uh, well, Jordan can score the ball. He's he's aggressive. He wants to he wants to be a good player. He's a tough kid. He's got a lot to learn. He got victimized a little bit. They ran hammer on him and back screened him and got got the shooter over in the corner a little bit. He can make shots. Uh, you know, he's he's still learning how to play, but he has to help us.